Guys, welcome to Vader Bow Hot Toys. Here comes another video. Stay tuned. <laughs> Hi guys, Vader by Hot Toys here, and here I am again. As promised, I did say I was going to do some more on my new Beast Sega figures. Um, I had two boxes arrive, I did show them the other day. Um, now I'm going to do a video of opening them up. Um, so these are the original, some of my Battle Beast. Um, I put a couple of my favourites on there, the Lion and the Tiger, and obviously the Shark. The reason why I got the shark in there, guys, because I've actually got a shark pack. So while we're talking about the shark, let's open the shark pack and see what's inside. So this is the box. Again, the artwork is very nice. Just like the lion, uh, it was a lion one, yet. So, Beast Sega. Now these are, I've done a bit of research on these, and I've, I, these have been out for years, guys, and I didn't even realise, because obviously, Battle Beast were just, Put on the back burner and put on display and I forgot all about them. And as those who are only watching videos on YouTube, that I realised that these Beast Sega were out. So, obviously being a toy collector, I've done what toy collectors do. And I went out and I picked some, picked some up. So, as usual guys, there's the dice and all that. Um, like other videos on YouTube, I don't know how to play the game. Um, I do realise that you have to put the dice in the chest and the chest fires out, rolls of dice. I can only assume, see, in, in the old um, the old Battle Beast, you'd rub it and it'd be fire versus water and water versus wood, that kind of stuff. So I can only assume that they'll flick their dice onto the floor and whoever's got the better token will win. A bit like Pokemon, really, but um, be Sega. Now guys, I've just opened, just got the three fins out, so there they are in their packaging. So let's get these open. So this is some kind of fish. So again guys, you know, you've you got the fire, you've got the water, and I've, so it is, it, is, it is a continuation of the Battle Beast. But these are called Beast Sega. The details on the Beast Sega figures are much better than the original. Um, they're bulkier, look a bit more mean. But um, obviously the, the weapons are very, like I said before in the previous video when I opened these guys, the weapons are pretty bendy. But they are only going on display. So this guy is pretty awesome. He's some kind of fish man. So I'm very happy with him. Let's just try and get him to stand up now. That's the fin. There you go. He's standing up. So that's all good. This guy looks like a piranha. So let's see what the piranhas are up to. So there, there he is. There's the piranha. Let's get out of the way, you. There you go. That's the piranha figure. Now guys, you know, the only thing about these is they have got these parts where, like I said, you, you push the button. So if you want to have the dice in their bins, in their stomachs, then of course they'll be on display with that at the back. Now that's not a problem if you're displaying from the front. But if you've got them on turn styles or anything like that, then that is going to show, as you can see with the original Battle Beast, as you can see, my lion's got an arm missing, but I have still got the arm. I think a bit of monkey glue may have to come in play. So what I do, guys, is I just I just don't have their dice in their stomachs. I will just have them like that. So you have got that bit sticking out of the back. Because let's, let's be honest, I'm not going to play the game. I am. I, I, these are only for show and to share with you guys. Um, I'm not going to buy too many more of these. Um, well, so I say that you never know, dear. So there's a, there's another fish guy. So these are these are pretty awesome guys. I mean, I don't know. This is the one that I really wanted. I can show you the comparison between these two. So this guy 
is the shark. Now, he's, he is pretty awesome to be fair. And he's the colour blue. You know I love the colour blue. So this is the comparison. There's the Battle Beast shark. I'm going to get my fingers out of the way. And there's the other shark. You can see the size difference. But they're both very nice figures. Let's just stick you back up there. Let's get the weapons out for this guy. So like I said guys, this, these are the water feature ones. Um, if you like to look, as this turnstile's going round, there is a special pack one. He's, he's all grey and see-through. He looks like a bit like an armadillo. And there's a bit of a story behind that. I bought it from Japan. In the picture there was eight figures. Um, but of course when it turned up, it was only him in the pack and it wasn't even the one I wanted really. He's probably my least favourite of the lot. Just my luck. But um, yeah, so in fairness, the company admitted their mistake and they gave me a partial refund, which is virtually most of the, most of the money, to be fair. Well, this guy's having trouble standing up. Come on, guy. There you go, there's a the shark man. So that's that pack, guys. So the last pack I've got is a tiger pack. So this could be another fire sign, I'm not 100% sure. But I know the line's definitely a... Oh, I'll pull the dice out. I do need to keep the dice further down the line. They are pretty nice. The different colours. These ones are like a ready see-through. And this one's two different shades of blue. I know in the lion pack I actually got a, um, a map or a game sheet. So, well this guy looks like a cat. So there, there he is, there's the cat man. He goes there, but I haven't put his weapons on yet. Yeah, so these are pretty cool, guys. If you uh, if you do like your battle beast, these are, are quite awesome to have them out on show. So there's the cat man with his weapons. I'm stick in there. Let's just spin this out a bit because I don't want to. So this one looks like a panda, Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> Sorry, I had to get it in now. I don't know, I'll put the weapons on in a minute. This, don't want to drag this video back too much, you get bored with it. So that's another one guys, that's the panda. So last but not least, this is another one that I really, really wanted. And this guy is absolutely awesome. And it's a tiger, and it's blue, and he's absolutely awesome. So he 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 will no doubt fight the lion. Guys, now if you go onto YouTube and put in Beast Sega, there's actually a cartoon for this toy line, which is pretty cool. I'm, I'm going to watch some tonight in work if I get a chance. So yeah, so guys. Well, I'm not going to waste my time putting these weapons on for you. So, Beast Sega figures, in my eyes, are definitely an eight out of ten. They look great on show. I love the I love the uh, Battle Beast, but this Beast Sega is really nice as well. It's a nice follow up. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry if it dragged out a little bit trying to open the epoxy bags, but it is. Thanks for those who keep subscribing. I've got loads more coming. I keep saying it. It's, oh, it's older and abroad at the moment. It's a pain in the backside of all this fucking corona and all that. But guys, thanks very much. I hope you're having a great day. This is Vader Bow Toys.
keep smiling thank you bye